And we found Wendy. And we got a treasure chest here. With the Patara chain. Which we don't really need. And I'm going to save here. <laughs> Just for the sake of saving. And we can go out here now. And this leads to sort of the upper deck that we were in before. And what you want to do is go out of the exit from the... Uh, captain's quarters from before and not drop down the trap door but actually go out through the door so I think that we can go back up from here uh, so I think we can or I guess not okay so we'll have to make our way around again so just go back around drop down here and then if I can get the camera to move, thank you. Jump back up here and go up this ladder again. And now that we've beaten the mini boss here, we get some heartless to fight. Not too hard since I mean you guys are just regular old heartless. So defeat these guys, get a little bit of EXP along the way. here quite accomplished that Riku running off with that girl without even saying goodbye run off where tell me where did he go to the ruins of hollow bastion where Maleficent resides but you won't be going there Unless you intend to leave your little pixie friend behind. <sighs> Hand over the keyblade and I'll spare your lives. Be glad I'm merciful, unlike the hard words. So, which will it be? The keyblade or the plank? The crocodile that took me hand. Oh, Shmi, he's after me other hand. I can't stay here. Go away. Oh, I can't stand the sight of him. Me, you take care of them. Thanks, Peter. Hey, don't mention it. You didn't think I'd leave you and Tink behind, did you?
and we've obtained the power of healing and we finally get oops i skipped the text but we finally get an upgrade to our heal spell cure gets upgraded to cura and peter pan has come back to save the day sort of but i'm not going to use him so too bad but now that we can fly in neverland um we get some flying mechanics and this is basically a flying tutorial circle to fly circle is rising and square is descending so it's basically the same as swimming except this time you have to double tap circle in order to actually start flying around. and as you can see flying is sort of like the memory controls um, uh, sort of like swimming controls, but flying is a lot better than um, swimming by a lot. But is it still kind of weird? A little bit. But at least it's manageable compared to swimming, which is really, really bad. And of course my party members are both down. This is the only time I'm gonna you're gonna see me healing the party members ever. Because usually I save the healing for myself. So Pretty much this is the tutorial of flying, so there's not really much to talk about, except defeat all the heartless and, and then you win. So, just defeat all the heartless here. And there's these airship pirates now. Now these guys you can actually get a lot of experience just by destroying their cannons on both sides. So these guys are pretty good for EXP grinding. However, usually you don't get to destroy both cannons. You only just either one. Or you destroy uh, one cannon, and I think the mast is also destroyable. So. And there we go. them off? Aye, Captain. They walked the plane. Every last one of them. <laughs> Peter Pan! <laughs> Ready to make a splash, you codfish? Now it's your turn to walk the plank. And of course, no world can be finished without a actual boss battle. So, as you could have told already, the boss is Captain Hook. And what I want to do is actually take care of this guy first over here. Because this guy's going to be annoying us through the whole fight. If I don't take care of him now. I think he respawns, but it takes him a while. So. And uh, when you fight Captain Hook, just be careful of that attack, um, which I think uh, pretty much doesn't let you counter it. Uh, but every other attack of his is fine. You can just counter it normally. And 
this guy is starting to annoy me, so I'll take him down again. And just aim for the boss again. This boss fight is a lot simpler compared to the uh, Shadow Sora fight that we just did. So, shouldn't have too many problems. It's always funny when he jumps overboard like that. So, give you some humorous moments during the fight. Okay, now I'm gonna fight this guy because I want to get some MP back, so... Him. And make my party members attack the Dallas. He's the actual boss in this place. And put a defense on myself again, a roll. I think arrow still? Yeah, it's arrow still. So ignore him and swap targets because I need some more MP again. And yeah, we're pretty much done with this fight. I'm just making it drag on a little. Uh, since I really want to defeat him without dying and want to beat him with as much HP as I have. Uh, where is he? He's over here. Okay, start smacking him again. And he's almost done, so let us deal the final blow. And we learned Ars Arcanum. And we get Ansem's report number nine. Oh, Kyrie couldn't wake up, so maybe she's really lost her. <gasps> Sora, I still can't believe it. It really flew. Wait till I tell Kyrie. I wonder if she'll believe me. Probably not. You can bring her to Neverland sometime. Then she can try it herself. If you believe, you can do anything, right? I'll find Kyrie. I know I will. There's so much I want to tell her about flying, the pirates, and everything else that's happened. What's that thing? What about the clock tower? You say there's something there.
And we can talk to Wendy now. And she says that we can find Kyrie and uh, we shouldn't give up. And we have a treasure chest here. And it's very important that you get this treasure chest right now. Or was it this one? <laughs> Maybe not this one. Uh, but you get a Flare G there. Uh, I know there's an important treasure chest somewhere here. 